Hi, welcome back. What I'm going to do today is a simple nail design that I decided to do for Super Bowl Sunday. And I picked this design because I figured it's easy, it's simple, and if you ladies are going to a Super Bowl party or you just want to do something fun and fancy with your nails, that you can do it. And it's something that, like I said, is easy. So, alright, so this is the look right here. I got the little football and the green turf, so if you want to see this design, just keep watching. So, are you ready? So, let's get started. Okay, first of all, what I did was I did set up the nails, kind of, but I'm going to do step by step so, I, so that you can see. Okay, so first of all, what you have to do, oh, right, this is, okay, we're going to do, I'm going to do the green nails first, then I'll do the, the the ball nails, the football nails, okay? So, this is the nail here. Okay, and first of all, when you do your nails, you always need to use a base coat, okay? Regardless, um, you're doing your toes, your nails, you always need to use a base coat. Um, the reason being is because if you use a lot of dark nail polishes, your fingernails can stain after a while. So, First of all, we have to put the base coat on. Okay. Okay. And then you have to let that dry completely. So what I did was, okay, I have a nail here that has a base coat on already and it is dry. Okay. And I'm using OPI. But what I'm going to do is I will mark everything down in the description box of exactly what I'm using, you know, the colors and stuff, because like I said, I just hate wasting a lot of time. And then, okay, I did go to, in cosmetology school, I went, and they always said, do never, never to shake your polishes, because they can get air bubbles, so it's always good to roll them in your hand, okay, instead of shaking them, because it can get air bubbles and make your nails have little bubbles, make the nail polish have bubbles in it when you put it on your nails. So, okay, so remember now, we have the base coat on here, so you want to start off with the top coat, I mean with the first coat, and I always use two coats of polish, but sometimes if you want to make it darker, you can use three, it's up to you, what kind of look you want to get. And this is um, China Glaze polish, and like I said, I'll put the, the color and the number down okay so that has to dry okay so that was the base coat that was the first coat and now I have one here that's already dry that was the first coat so now we're gonna do a second coat I love this color I think it's so pretty and this is um, what I have a stand for, this is the green turf of the football field. <laughs> I thought that was kind of cute. <laughs> okay, so there's your second coat. Okay, so that has to dry. And then I have, I have it all set up here. Okay, and then this was the second coat. So now what we're going to do, like I said, this was um, China Glaze. Okay. Okay, so now I'm using the sparkly color. You can use, I mean, any colors you want. I mean, green or, you know, brown or whatever. You don't have to use the exact same ones I'm using. But um, let me roll this real quick. Okay. That's what they told me in nail school to do, so that's why I do it like that. Okay, so now with me, I just, I just don't like that plain doll look, so I want to get a little bling to it. <laughs> so I'm going to put this on to get that little sparkle, sparkle bling, to make it look nice. You can just like keep putting it on, kind of like dab dabbing it on. It all depends on how many sparkles you want on there, you know? I like a lot of bling bling, so. Okay, and like I said, all the colors and the names of the polishes I will be put in the description box for you. So that's the little, the bling bling. Okay, and I'm going to put this here to dry. Okay, 
okay and here's one that's already dried so that's how it looks and then we finish it off with OPI top coat to give that extra shine shine <laughs> okay so that is the the end result of the turf <laughs> the football foot like my nail so okay so that's that okay okay now we're gonna move on to the football okay so I have to turn this around okay and basically I have to do the same thing I have base coat. Ah, I'm going to put the base coat on first. Okay, so so this one is um, I'm sorry, I did that wrong. <laughs> blooper! 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 This one I have to do. Blooper, blooper. Okay. Put the base coat on. Okay. Okay. Then this is the one that has a base coat and that is dry. <laughs> okay. So we're going to put our first coat of this polish which this polish is really nice I don't know if you'll be able to see it ladies up close but it has like a little shimmer to it it's OPI it's really really pretty huh I love it but I don't know if you can see the shimmer but it is gorgeous and you put your first coat on First coat that is here that is already dry, so we're going to do our second coat. I think this is just so cute, and like I said, it's so simple and easy to do. I, I just want to do something simple and easy for you guys, so you know, not something real complicated that you know. Okay, look at, I don't know if you can see that little shine to it, but it just has a, like a little glow to it. It's so pretty. Okay, so that's that. Okay. That was the second coat. Okay, now, <laughs> this, is the, this is the fun part. <laughs> okay, now we're going to make the football lines, okay? Now, I do have, they do have pens that you can use. I do have one actually they do have these that you can use and you know it does have a, a top okay pen like this but personally I really don't like using them because I'm so used to doing it freehand but they do make it a lot easier for somebody that would like to use it so and that's that they look like that and, okay but this is what I use okay I use these I, I really like these a lot <laughs> so you have to have a steady hand, and I'm not always perfect at it, you know, you make mistakes, but, you know, you do the best you can, but I like doing freehand. So, and basically, that's all you do is take your striper brush, and just make sure you don't get too much polish on there, okay? And you just draw a line, okay? And then you do one about about right here. You want to do one like about right there. Okay? And then you want to do another one about right here. And then you want to do one more about right here. 
Yeah, you see how simple that is? And that gives you your little football look. Okay? So that's that. So that has to dry. Make sure that dries really well because if you put the clear coat on last, it'll smear the white. So you really want to make sure. Okay, so this is really, this is dry. Okay, so we want to put the top coat on to make that shine. And like I said, make sure it's dry because you know, lest the white will smear. So that's it. There you got your turf, you got your football, you got your nails, and this is what they look like at the end. <laughs> so, okay, so, all right. So I hope you enjoyed that. I mean, it, it, I hope you enjoyed it. It was simple and easy and just something fun to do. So, and like I said, I will write down below the names of the polishes and the number and stuff like that so if you guys did want to do it and I did do it a little bit early I know Super Bowl not this Sunday it's next Sunday but I wanted to do it so give you guys a chance if you guys did want to pick up the polish or something like that so all right I appreciate all you guys for watching and um, thumbs up if you will please subscribe and we're gonna get into a lot more other things and I do have a small review coming up next that I'm gonna do okay so keep watching. Okay, I love all you guys. Okay, hugs and kisses. All right, I'll see you. Bye-bye.